Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the official He-Man and the Masters of the Universe YouTube channel. My name is James Etock and today I thought it would be fun to showcase the rarely seen He-Man animation test. Don't be scared. But first, a little backstory. As many of you know, Filmation Studios, in order to keep costs low on their shows and subsequently keep the animation industry alive and well in the United States, employed a stock animation system. Layer artists, animators and animation directors created many cell sequences that featured the characters walking, running, jumping and, most memorably of all, landing. Oh, Teela. Although Filmation had their stock system in place, certain directors encouraged new animation. Often this process would start with the storyboard artist who, for example, would decide that rather than have He-Man walk up and simply punch the screen, it would look far more striking to have a wide shot of the most powerful man in the universe punching and tearing his way through the ship's hull. Look at him go. Interestingly, some of the storyboard artists who were often striving for new animation in the episodes they boarded had trained as animators themselves. Tom Sito was one such artist. However, he was not allowed to just begin animating on the show and was required to take the in-house animation test. Tom Sito was given three sheets of paper. On each of these three sheets was a different pose of He-Man. Tom's task was to get He-Man from point A to point B and finally to point C. In this test you can see that the artist was not necessarily required to draw the character on model, but showed that they had an understanding of the basic fundamentals of animation and the way a character should move. Somewhat ironically, the animation test often required the artist to illustrate more frames than he or she would in an actual episode of He-Man. Having passed the test, Tom Cito would go on to animate a few rather notable scenes in the series, such as the death of Evil Seed from the episode Evil Seed. There will be another season. Not until 2002, my friend. He-Man's incredibly painful looking fall from Search for the VHO. Cringer being frightened by lightning from the episode Return of Evil. He-Man ripping a gate from its hinges from Castle of Heroes. Cringer climbing over Adam scared out of his wits from the episode The Huntsman. And the aforementioned He-Man punch from the episode The Heart of a Giant. As a bonus, here's my attempt at the filmation animation test. Are you ready? I think it's safe to say that Formation would never have hired me. I hope you enjoyed this video, please feel free to leave comments below, like and share this video, and subscribe to the channel, please.